So just go to our website. Again, go to our website. It's a cornucopia of information. A oh cornucopia. Got a growing slideshow. So yeah, yeah. It's really cool to see all the graduates. Add a senior you love to that uh, that growing list. We'll take a quick break. Time now is 5:57. Coming up the next hour, we have details on a plan by state officials to reopen schools this summer to try and make up for lost time. Will the fall semester start earlier? Well, we'll take a look at that, and then a look at the disturbing new trend of criminals pretending to have the coronavirus to try and extract things from victims. We'll tell you more about what's going on. AAA Home Insurance is about the people inside and making sure they have everything they need, like guaranteed replacement coverage and savings when you bundle auto and home. AAA. AAA Auto Insurance is about the people inside the car and making sure they have everything they need, like a AAA membership with roadside assistance, local agents, and nationwide auto repair experts. AAA. Right now, staying connected is more important than ever, and fast, reliable, secure internet from Xfinity can help. We have plans to fit every budget with speeds up to a gig, all at Xfinity.com. We'll ship you a self-install kit that makes setup quick, safe, and easy. No tech visit required. And our simple digital tools will help you manage your account online. At Xfinity, we're committed to keeping you connected. Find great offers and value today at Xfinity.com. Insurance said my accident case was only worth $2,000, but I called the Barnes firm and got nearly $900,000 more. They got me $550,000 more. I'm Steve Barnes. Is your accident case worth more than the insurance company says? Call us. You might be surprised. I called. The Barnes firm got me $600,000. What's your case really worth? Call us now and find out for free. The Barnes firm. one 800 8 million now, from the Bay Area's local news station, you're watching the Crawford Morning News at 6. Governor Gavin Newsom says kids could be physically back in the classrooms by July, but not everybody likes it, including many school districts. I'll explain coming up in a live report. And breaking overnight, CHP investigating a freeway shooting on Interstate 80 that injured two people. We're live with the latest details. Good morning, thank you for joining us on this Wednesday, April 29th. I'm James Fletcher. And I'm Daria Folsom, and here's a surprise. Governor Newsom says the new school year in California might start early, as early as July or August. Yeah, to try and make up for some of the lost days at the end of this school year, Crumpers will try and live in Berkeley to explain. Will? James Doria, the kids we all know have not been in school for five weeks, but if the governor and it's still decision process processing, so it's not concrete yet, but if the governor probably has it his way, the kids could be back in the classrooms as early as late July. The governor says there has been a noticeable learning loss, especially in many homes that don't have internet, and whenever that happens, it's more prevalent in communities of color, and he's noticed that as